Hi, you guys. This is Prophetess of Phil Sabrina Acapo, and I am back again. Build the leading of the Holy Spirit with a nada prophetic word for you guys. And as with any prophetic word, you would absolutely want to go to the Lord in prayer, testing the spirit to affirm and confirm that perhaps this prophetic word is for you. Holy Spirit, I invite you in to take full charge, to take full control, to take full access. I decrease as you increase. Allow me to bring forth your word with your glory, with your power, with your grace, with your mercy. Telling your story so your name can be glorified for the winning of souls to the gospel of Jesus Christ and Jesus Christ's mighty name that I do pray. Amen, 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 and amen. Tidy, you guys, of this prophetic word is you are about to get a whole new wardrobe and set of clothes you're about to get a whole new wardrobe and set of clothes and let me jump off into this word you guys so you guys i was doing laundry today <laughs> and so i go back to get the clothes and the clothes are not there now i could have did one or two things but you know what i said i'm gonna take the positive out of that situation that I'm not going to pen it because God gave me a revelation immediately. Maybe I want you to have a whole new set of clothes, but I know definitely that it's not just me. He wants to have that new wardrobe, that new set of clothes because he said he's lifting you. You're going to the next level. You're going to the next dimension. You're going influential. So I want your clothes to change. See, things happen for a reason. Because when God wants to provide signs and wonders and miracles, that is exactly what he's going to do. You may not understand the revelation once that thing happens. But when you really sit and think about that thing and meditate on that thing, and then you go into prayer, God going to bring you that thing full circle. And it's going to be full fledged because he wants you to know that he's already two steps ahead of you. He's already gone before you and granted you that grace and I merited favor. And the Lord is saying he's making everything new in your life. That go to 2 Corinthians 5 and 17. That when you are in Christ, you are a new creation. The old has gone and the new is here. The Lord is wanting you to know he's changing your wardrobe. That he's changing. I hear the coat of many colors that your whole situation and circumstance, your whole life is about to change. Because the Lord is saying even, even like just everything full circle all the way around the spectrum. Like you're about to get new helpers. You're about to get new friendships. Like every, he's talking about a lifting from every array, from every arena. And the Lord is saying where you're about to go in the rooms and the people that you are about to be around, you're going to have to have. The Lord is saying he's upgrading your wardrobe. He's upgrading your style. For some of you guys, the Lord is saying he's placing people in your life where you're going to have a stylist in place. Come on through, Holy Spirit. You're going to have a stylist in place that's going to give you that wardrobe on a daily basis because where you are going is going to be, I'm telling you, out of this world. Because the Lord is saying influential. So the Lord is wanting to make you worldwide. And I know this was not just set for me, but the Lord wanted me to bring this thing here because when I re really thought about that thing on the situation of what happened, I was like, what would Jesus do? <laughs> then Jesus gave me that revelation to begin speaking and auctioning in my spirit. I'm about to give you a new set of clothes. I'm about to do your job on you. I'm about to give you twice as much than you had before. I'm opening a new door. Look at it from, don't look at it from a natural perspective. Look at it from a spiritual standpoint. You got to know that old new old wineskins and new wineskins do not mix. So I can't mix the old in with the new. And when I'm doing a new thing and when I'm doing a new season, and when I'm doing a new you, and when I'm rebirthing that thing, and when I'm relaunching that thing, and when I'm re-strategizing that thing, and when I got another strategized plan, I got a new plan that will stand, that will cause you to stand in settlement, that will cause you to stand in promise, that will no longer cause you to stand in distant. I got to change your clothes. I got to change your clothes. You can, Oh, you can't wear the same garments. The Lord is saying, because this is going to be something spectacular. The Lord is saying, this is something that you ain't never had. I'm dressing you because my hands are in this and my hands are on you. Some of you guys, he's going to put stylus in place. I am telling you, God is lifting you. 
God is promoting you. God is raising you. It's going to be twice as much than you ever had before. You're about to get a royal experience. You're about to get a, a royal wardrobe. I hear the Holy Spirit saying so clearly that I'm changing your clothes. You've been faithful over a few things. Now I'm making you rulers over men. I'm making you rulers over plenty. You're in your season of plenteous. And with being in that season of plenteous, I got to change your clothes. You can't be in the season of plenteous and have, still have that old stuff. The Lord has said, not even that old mentality. You're coming in with a new mentality. You're coming in with a new mindset. My chosen elect, my chosen remnant. That you're going to be able to walk it out because I've already worked it out. I've gone before you and made all of your crooked pathways straight. I've gone before you and ordered and orchestrated your steps. I've gone before you and changed your clothes. I've gone before you and changed your garment. I'm faithful to perform it. And if you trust me, you will see that your wardrobe is in the house. And it's already worked out. It's already been launched and released to you. Just be an expectation because the Lord has said it's going to be no lying, no waiting. He's got people set in place. Angels have dispatched on your behalf. I'm changing your clothes. I'm changing your garment. I'm giving you that coat of many colors. I'm giving you that Job circumstance. Twice as much. You know, I talked about in the previous video, a hundredfold return. The Lord is wanting you to know he's doing just that. The Lord has said it's not going to be limited, but it's going to be limitless because he is a limitless God. There's no, there are no limitations on him. And the Lord has said, you can't put a price tag on those clothes because you get, he wants you to be in a situation to where you can go and get what you want to get when you want to get it. And not just going, just splurging and buying things, but the Lord is wanting you to have this because he's wanting you to have the best of the best of the best of the best. And that starts with changing your clothes. And he's not just talking about the clothes that's on your body. Thank you, Jesus. He's talking about look at this thing and activate this thing as a spiritual thing in your life. And know that it goes beyond the natural realm. The Lord is saying a supernatural change of your clothes, a change of your status, a change of your name. Because a good name is better than riches. I'm talking about an all around sediment. I'm talking about 1 Peter 5 and 10. I'm restoring you. I'm confirming you. I'm establishing you. I'm strengthening you. I am settling you. And I'm changing your clothes that you have what it takes because you have chose my hand to hold and I've got you I've got you you have entered in your promise you have entered into your promotion you've been set aside for my use for such a time as this and it starts with that garment change. It starts with that name change. It starts with that promotion. It starts with that settlement. It starts with that rearranging. You know, I just talked about this previously. And this can kind of connect and coincide with the previous video. But the Lord is wanting you to know. Look at that thing from a supernatural perspective and activate that thing in your life. Because the Lord is wanting to change everything that even gave you a problem. He wants you to know he's changing your clothes because he wants that problem to be solved today. He wants you to know that he has made a way out of no way because he is the way. He is the truth. He is the life. No one comes through the Father except through Jesus Christ that he is our great I am. He is our bright and morning star. And I'm starting with that. I'm taking you far because I want you to have my best. And I'm starting out by changing your government. I'm starting out by changing your clothes. I'm bringing you out. I'm bringing you out because you cannot no longer be at the back of the line. But I place these garments in richness. I place these garments in wealth for you to be at the forefront. Take that step. Take that face step. The Lord has said, I double dare you because I'm about to change that garment for you. I'm about to change those clothes for you. You guys, 
tap into this word because I am feeling it so heavy in my spirit. I'm telling you, the Lord has his way of how he does things that we may not understand. He's saying, think it not strange that I'm changing your garment. Think it's not strange that I'm changing your name. For some of you, this could be a two-part word pertaining to marriage, Miss MRS. Get something that's a point of contact. Get something that's a connection because I'm changing your garment. Definitely let these principles and practicalities reign in your life as you see fit of it pertaining to every aspect and area of your life because the Lord wants you to know that there's about to be some drastic, rapid changes of your garments. And this is the season and this is the time that is being launched. Those garments could mean those books. Those garments could mean those channels. Those garments could mean your marital assignment. Those garments could mean your destiny. Those garments could mean that job. Those garments could mean that key to open that door to your new home. That garment could mean that key to your car. That garment could mean the key to the kingdom. Apply it as you see fit to your life because I'm telling you, the Lord is changing your garment. I'm changing your clothes. I'm giving you that coat of many colors. I'm taking out of the old stuff and I'm placing in that new wine. You're walking in your suite along with your new garment. That said, the spirit of the living God in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. I love each and every one of you guys. Always praying for each and every one of you guys. Do like, share, and subscribe, you guys. Don't forget to go over there on Destined for Marital Bliss 1000 and subscribe in that house because you're going to have the same on this channel. You're going to have that exceptional content coming on a daily basis because that's a mantle that the Lord has definitely poured on me. And I walk in obedience to fulfill that assignment fully and with intentionality so God can be glorified. So like, share, and subscribe as well on that channel, you guys. Can't wait to get started over there. I can just feel just the oil over there on that channel. God has already gone before me over on that channel and placed favor on that channel. Destined for marital bliss. 1,000 subscribe in the house. I love you guys. Always praying for each and every one of you guys. May the Lord richly bless each and every one of you guys and see you guys all through to the greatness of success in our new garment, our new change, our new name, our new land where we will stand in rich, fertile soil. And it will be continuous, a continuous flow. A continuous flow of the change of your garment. A continuous flow of the change of your clothes. A continuous outpour of your soul much more. In the mighty name of Jesus Christ, take care. I love you guys once again. And we will most certainly talk on the next. God bless you. Bye-bye.